Ah, uh, because I need to get some goddamn shields, because I'm now in the last stand. I wanted one more block of shields. Okay, so now we are at the last stand. This is the boss fight. So I arrive at the heart of the last Federation fleet. Uh, so people are like, what's the meaning of this? Who are you? And then I'm all like, uh, bro, I have intel. And so I have to explain the weaknesses of the enemy fleet. And he goes, okay, well, guess what? It's all up to you, my friend. You have to go and fuck up the, the warships. And I'm like, okay, I got this shit, bro. All right, let's go to repair thing first. Because usually these give you some missiles or some other crap like that. Also, the music gets really good here. Yeah, that's kind of nice. That is the flagship, by the way. That is the final boss. That is what we have to kill here. Are you guys ready? I, uh, personally, I was born ready. Fortunately, I have low defensive options against a guy like this. I really fucking want to have better shields. Oh my god. I'm gonna... Is, is there a store nearby? I'll sell my, sell my fucking shit. I love ion bombs. Go, ion bomb. I choose you. Look at that. Oh, man. Except I missed every other fucking shot. Damn it. They're really nice. So much ion. I don't get that much ion. Oh, now I'm kind of sad because now my ion cannon's gone. Oh, oh. No, no. You need to go there. You guys can go help this guy. Good thing I had uh, the giant railfuck cannon. I didn't get nearly enough scrap this time, I'll be honest. Uh, I, I don't even have my railgun fully upgraded. I simply couldn't afford it. Because uh, I had to buy all these weapons, uh, except for the ion bomb, obviously. You, you just witnessed me getting that. For the love of God, stop shooting that. Oh wait, I have like no power in that right now. Thanks a lot, dick game. I'm very fortunate in the fact that uh, I'm able to shoot that down. Okay, come on. Go, burst laser. Yeah. No! <laughs> oh, fuck. That's, they, do, they do my strategy of cloaking exactly at the right moment. Alright. I'm, I'm not too pleased right now. This, this could be going better, I won't lie. I don't really need power in that right now. Yes, take out all my shields, you son of a bitch. Okay, railgun please, for the love of god, railgun. It's, it's, all up to, it's all up to the railgun. You have to trust in the railgun. You can get the hell out of that room. Oh, for the love of Christ. Hopefully it doesn't blow up. Uh, well, actually no. It, it has one more thing left. Stop, stop, stop fire. Thank you. Thank you, fire. Go away. Also, the music is incredible here. I, I really like the soundtrack. You gotta be kidding me. Unfortunately, this is like the worst situation I've ever been in. Because it's like... You would- it's like two things left. It's like the railgun needs to do it. Uh, and the fact that I only have two shields is not helping here, and the fact that he's constantly screwing over my- Well, the railgun's about to finish this, so... The railgun always finishes this. Okay, well, we got a bunch of items, so let's go and, uh... It's a necessity, I need to get- I need to get that, that's it. I have to. If I get more power, more power to me, but uh, I'm going to use a hull repair drone, except I don't have enough power. Uh, actually, I need that. Hi, hull repair. I mean, I'll, I'll divert power from from anything, really. Like, it doesn't matter. I, I need those, I need the three blocks of shields to live through this next part, so. Alright. I right, can't get back on driving. As, as, as much as that goes against my better judgment, get back on fucking dr driving, you ass. Alright. We need the ion bomb. Yeah, we just, we're lacking in one, so. Well, let's go to that repair station if we can, maybe. Demand surrender of goods. Yes. Fortunately, they're about to run away. 
Uh, I'll let these guys do it. They're my... They're my gangsters. So I'm gonna let the, um... The ion bomb set off. There. Now they have absolutely no fucking... Anything. That's why that is so no What the hell? Oh, I did not mean to click you. Well, you guys ran away, so... You're... You're fucking lost. I have a missile here, but I haven't actually seen them, witnessed them using it yet. That's okay, though. You know, if they don't want to use their missile, it's, it's actually perfectly fine by me. I, I, I will not complain. Well, I can jump now, but that's a terrible idea. There we go. Okay. Well, uh... 50 scrap. That's enough to get another power bar. This is the best I could possibly hope for. Uh, there's a store right there. I'm gonna go to the store real quick. I'm sorry, guys. You'll have to hear me apologize. Alright. Let's see. Stealth weapons, completely useless for me. Scrap recovery arm, completely useless. However, I can sell my scrap recovery arm because I will no longer need that. And buy more. nothing, actually. So, that's where I want to go next. Okay. Let's, uh, this is the big fight, guys. So, let's go make sure that we have all my upgrades. I think it would be in my best interest to get doors at this point and internal cameras. I will get O2 as soon as I can. Uh, after this fight, I should get a bit of a bonus, but uh, the doors and stuff will really help. This is the Rebel Flagship. This is the final boss. Welcome. He cloaks. He's a fucking asshole. <laughs> So, uh, this is how I play. Um, I like the ion stuff because I can take out their shields much better. And, uh, so the strategy here is that, uh, you don't want to kill everyone on the ship because then the automated thing will kick in. And it just occurred to me that defense drone will be required. Okay, I got one in there. Uh, let's go take him off defense and aim back into shields. This is the one problem. Okay, let's go put th some things into here. I love the ion bomb, but it's just... I can't do it right now. Okay, go ion bomb. I choose you. So I'll just keep these guys over here just chilling. Having more evade would have let I would have liked that, and also I can't kill this guy. Oh boy. Oh shit, I didn't put my thing back on. Well, that's my bad. I should put my... I really want to kill this guy a lot, but as I said, my current setup is uh, made in such a way that I have to... Uh, I have to wait for him. Even if I eye on him, I'm still good with that. Uh oh, you need to go and repair that right now. Actually, uh, just everyone can go. Oh, Jesus. I hate the missiles so much. I can't put on my fucking defense drone because there's no power in it. That's okay, though. It's uh, still kind of nice. Oh, there we go. I killed him. That's it. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right. Uh, I'll just target... Uh, uh, I'll target this guy. No, actually, no, this guy. Okay, we don't need to waste any more ion bombs. Uh, so I'm going to get rid of that. Ion bombs, it's like four ion damage. It's fucking great. For, like, the price of a bomb? I couldn't even give a shit about bomb ammo. I have 28, it's good enough. Alright, so he destroyed half, we destroyed half of him, but we gotta keep it up. Um, now this is a boss, by the way, that gets progressively more difficult, actually, as you progress through the, uh, like, the second phase is arguably the most difficult. Um, uh, it honestly depends upon what you specialize in taking, like, dealing with. If you're really good at dealing with, um, people who board your ship, the next phase will be really easy. Uh, if you're really good at dealing with, I don't know, um, just trying to think, uh, Jay is, it, it, as I said, it all depends on what, what you excel at, what, what you're really good at dealing with. If you're good at, like, shields and shit, then you'll have good shields or whatever, like, for the next part, I guess, as well. I don't know. Uh, O2, just so we don't lose that. 
Uh, the piloting I hope, I hopefully will not have a problem with, but you know, we never truly knew. But whatever, okay. The next part's gonna be interesting. Wish I could, wish I could have more, uh, power bars, but it, that will not be the case here. We have to chase him, so, my current location. He's apparently jumping here. I don't know why he's in range in three. He's, he's kind of a weirdo. So, uh, he's heavily damaged, but he has considerable power in his drones. It's fucking awful. So, this is one of the problems, is right here. He's gonna, uh, let's go divert power to engines. We don't actually need this right now. I'm gonna be hitting that as soon as I can, because that missile thing is actually probably my worst enemy. There we go. I love taking out my worst enemy. Okay, let's, let's go and leave this guy wherever he's going. Now, this, now he has a power surge detected. What is that, you ask? He fires a fuck ton of drones at me. The excellent part is that uh, we just took out that. So I'm gonna put, put all the power I can into evasion right now, because look at how many goddamn drones there are right now. Nothing I can do can get rid of this. I just have to hope that they miss for the most part. And they're not. Okay. Let's go get our shields back. Right now I am targeting that. Uh, I'm targeting his drone center so he won't s launch any anything else at me. Like an ass wipe. And maybe maybe he'll slow down his other things, so that's I'm I'm hoping it's a sound theory to me, so no, I guess not. He has all the drones. And all my entire fucking ship's on fire. This is uh this is how I die, guys. Uh I Luckily I just took him out. I was very fortunate enough that I'm actually very heavily equipped for this uh kind of a situation. Unfortunately, I don't think I can buy another thing, but I can buy hull repair drones, so I guess I'll be doing that. Uh, that, that, that was amazing. <laughs> yeah, let's get some more internal sensors. That, wow, we had two of these and it's still... You see, it's yellow, so like they took out one layer of it, so having the double probably helped in this case. Uh, let's see, who else needs... Jay. Jay, go get some healing love, babe. We love you. Okay, so, um, I think the hard part is out and done, and I think I'm already won, but, uh, you know, nothing's for certain, guys. Mike may still play really dumbly and, you know, do something really retarded, like, derp, let's lower shields. Divert power from shields to, uh, the arcade. We have an arcade on our ship. No, we don't. Alright, well, is there anything in the upgrades I could actually buy? I guess I might as well buy piloting. Now they can't take out my piloting, which is kind of nice. All right. Now, last one. Oh, actually, no, 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 fuck it. What am I doing? Sorry, I have many hull repair drones still to do. We love hull repair drones. You see, I won't be able to do this during the fight as easily, but like, this is the best part of this shit, of the hull repair drones. Cause I can just fucking use them like as much as I want. And like, nobody will stop me. Maybe nobody will stop me. I don't know. <laughs> of course nobody will stop me. They're my hull repair drones. But this is one of the best things you can do. Yeah. Okay. I know it's just one, but I might as well. That one can make all the difference. You don't actually know. Don't fucking judge me. Alright. Power do the ion bomb. Go. This is the last one, guys. If I do this, I win. We all want Mike to win, right? You're not cer you're not certain how it's keep uh, how it can keep fighting with the damage it's sustained. However, uh, it's transferred power to teleport as well, so we got a super weapon. They can now teleport to my ship. So uh, we'll let them do that. I was I was kind of hoping that they would. Uh... These are max level fighters, by the way, so they'll they'll fuck with me pretty pretty hard. I need, I need power to that. Uh, I'll put it into defense drone. 
It, why do they always hate doors? Like, door, what, what have doors ever done to you? Okay, well, we're killing their guys, so... Why is it this important that you kill us? Okay, they're doing another power surge, and I'll show you what that is in just a minute. We have to vent the compartment. Luckily, the rail, the rail gun is actually fucking helping here. Okay, let's put power back into shields. This is what he does. <laughs> oh boy. Yes, that's exactly what he does. Luckily, I am still in the okay for this. I don't know if I've taken- I don't think I've actually taken that out fully yet. Uh, no, I haven't. Which means I have to divert power from shields to defense drone. Go! And he missed! Good. Excellent. Uh, now we need to put power back. Well, let's actually put it into hull repair. Why not? Uh oh. Uh. Uh, in just a second, I'm gonna put it back into shields, actually. Oh boy. He he hits pretty hard when he does that. He really does. Uh, luckily, I have like O2 power. I think I diverted power from it anyways. At some point, I should probably put it back in. Because he's about to die. We are so close to killing him. That's it. The valiant effort of the USS Railfuck. A successful crew of Kent, Mike Lad, Jay, and Callus was just not meant to be. Well, that's it. That's uh, that's the game, and uh, very, very, very extremely addi addi um, the addictive. I highly recommend it. It's uh, just absolutely wonderful. Uh, brilliant, guys. Music is great. Uh, the programming is great. The writing is great. Don't be turned off by the graphics. Uh, I mean, you've watched it all the way through. Uh, it's it's absolutely great. It's so much fun, and uh, this is not the last playthrough that I'm doing of this. Uh, you're gonna actually be seeing more. It's like it took all week, I know, but there's these um, stealth fighters which you'll actually be seeing next. I'm gonna do some of those, and those are gonna be actually really really fun to to show off. Because usually those are very difficult, but I think I've done actually pretty good with them. So uh, I hope I haven't made anyone pull their hair with like, oh god, you fucking did something. So I don't know. <laughs> like people, people get very frustrated by little fuck ups in this game, and I'm not perfect. I am farthest from perfect, but uh, I managed to beat it on normal. That's it. That's uh, my normal run. Of this I won't be doing any easy runs. I'm just gonna do normal and stuff. So maybe I'll do. So my plan is both of the cloaking, uh, both of the the the, the stealth ships. So they they have cloaking on them. Uh, and also one of uh, also a boarding ship, probably the crystal one. And then I'll see I'll see if there's anything else that necessarily interests me that I want to show off. That that's you know usually difficult or interesting play styles. Uh, but those are the ones I can think of off the top of my head that are really interesting. I don't think there's a whole lot of let's plays of them because usually people use the default ships because they haven't unlocked some of the other ones. So I'd rather do let's plays of uh, the ones that would actually be cool to show off to you guys. Uh, and yeah, as I said, um, you know, if you want this game, it's on uh, it's on Steam, and it's also on Good Old Games, and it's also off the FTL website. And if you buy it off the FTL website, uh, you get the humble bundle version, which is essentially uh, you get DRM free versions of Windows and Linux, and I think Mac as well. Uh, so if you're uh, any of those, it's great. Um, and also, they give you Steam Key anyway, so it's the same thing as buying on Steam. So I highly recommend you buy it off uh, actually the FTL website uh, that comes with the mic seal of approval. And I say good job to these developers because this is, as I said, I, I wasn't really into the Kickstarter and stuff. I kind of, I heard about it, but I didn't actually know if I'd want to play it. But it's like a space sim I would, you'd think I would want to. And I don't know why I didn't check it out more. And it wasn't until Ken and Kalos kind of forced me that I fucking actually looked at it. And then <laughs> now I did a playthrough of it, and I'm gonna do a couple of playthroughs. And I've been I've been really uh, hoping to show you guys this as, as soon as possible. I love it. It's so much fun to me, and it is the random element. And as I said, if you're getting frustrated because you can't beat the game, you you have to you kind of have to be like very tactical and also pause the game a lot and just like kind of go, what is the best thing for me to be doing right now? 
you know, kind of weigh all the outcomes in you in your mind, uh, kind of thing. And that's and that's how that's how you beat this game. Um, there is no doubt that you can get really unlucky. You can get really unlucky to the point where you just you you die, and it's just it just sucks. You know, like what can you do? Um, but uh, on the other hand, it's also like a good idea. It, it's 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 also it just helps you kind of like get into the ta tactical mindset and that the tactical LP mindset. Uh, <laughs> and uh, it's it helps with other games too. To be honest, it's, it's actually a great skill to learn, kind of a thing. Like just thinking on your feet. And and as I said, if you're if you're having trouble, pause the game more. Uh, there is no situation that requires live. Uh, live actions from you so take as much time as you need to think it all out i was kind of trying to play a little bit faster because i am showing it on video and stuff like that i don't know if that screwed me um as i said i made two mistakes two or three mistakes who knows uh and it happens and you learn you, you every time you play you learn you go i shouldn't have done this shouldn't have done that should do this kind of thing and that's i think that's what makes it great it's a it's a great learning experience kind of thing and i can see a lot of mods coming out for this um so a couple ones i'm talking too much over uh, the soundtrack and stuff. I had a lot to say. And I was trying to teach it off and all that kind of stuff. But I think it's really cool. I think it's really great that they made a wonderful multi-platform game. Uh, so Half-Life 1 and 2 fonts uses permission. Huh. What do you... Oh, I didn't actually know these were the Half-Life fonts. I don't, didn't recognize them. It was, it was a fantastic run-through and I, I hope you all enjoyed. And here we go. We've crushed... The, the ship and this is this is it um, I guess this is another USS real fuck that I did most piloted invasions canned good going canned yeah I've, I've done a bunch of USS real fuck this is kind of like my my go-to name for this this ship um, and my cloud is obviously the one with the most combat kills Catalos is the one with the most repairs good job Catalos you did your death was not in vain and uh, most ships defeated 39. So you got to see all of that. It's really cool. Also, there was an achievement I got. Uh, you guys, I don't think saw it, but it was like um, this one. Hit at least every room with a bit one beam under one five seconds. That if you didn't know that that beam that you saw was really random. So I got this one really randomly. It was actually kind of cool. I hit every ship on uh, every that. Uh, Hit every room in, on the ship, which is I've never done that before. So that's kind of cool. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough, and I'll see you for my next stealth uh, playthrough. So, bye.